This this feels so calming. It feels like such a chill <laughs> game. I don't want to like start with hype energy. With Mario Party, it was so easy because all I had to do was be loud. Alright guys, well Marks and I are here sitting on this couch, we're about to check out this new game called Deru, it just came out today, and apparently it's going to be testing um, our ability to cooperate together, so as opposed to the classic Evan getting mad at Marcus and Marcus getting mad at Evan gameplay that you're used to seeing on this channel, we're going to see if we can actually work together for once. Yes. Alright, let's play. We're big, we're big Little Croy fans here. Okay. Whee! Oh, oh, oh. So, I guess in this case, you're black. <laughs> and I'm white. <laughs> <laughs> guess so. Ooh. You got a hood pass tonight, Evan. <laughs> you know what that means. There's certain words you can say for tonight and tonight uh, only. Uh, uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> so just, oh man, I'm blank. <laughs> just blank for your name. Go ahead and go ahead and say it if you want. Oh, I'm, I'm not. I'm not doing that. I'm not gonna. He's not down, dude. So far, this is uh, pretty, pretty simple. Yeah. Um. What happens if I touch the flag? Oh, you die. We both disintegrate. Oh, we okay. both die. Go ahead, let you through. But you have to, you have to be down. Ah, oh, you ah. son of a! <laughs> okay, you killed me. We had a pass. Okay, okay, pass. okay, okay. Come down below. Come down and, and, and block it. Uh, what's that? No, I don't know. Just come down and then go under me. Oh. Yeah. Nope, that's not gonna work, right? I oh, know it is. Yeah. The controls are a little like it's like delayed. Stiff. Yeah, yeah, stiff. There's a bit of um, like inertia. Yeah. Can you? Um, I can come down to you. This is just Whoa. hey buddy. A How repeat, a more complicated version of that last one. Okay, well you were the one who understood what was going on last time. I need to get down here. So should I be here? And I can help you. The thing but is, then I'm, but then you're gonna be, you're not gonna be a good place. I have a feeling this is gonna be kind of like. Have you ever played Portal Two cooperatively? Uh, yeah. I have a feeling it's gonna be like that, where where one person is gonna be carrying the team, and just tell the other person. So, <laughs> get ready to put me on your back, Marcus. Um. So what are we doing right now? I'm just gonna go. Yeah. I'm just gonna. Go. You go figure it out. You got this. Well, actually. Get me across. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Oh. Okay. Okay, okay. Start. Start and get it. Oh, look at that. And, yep. then, and then I can just go up. Being, being selfish is a good thing, you guys. This is what I'm learning right now. <laughs> just, not, just, just go for the thing that, that you want to get to. That's not the lesson in life. No, but that's my that's my takeaway from from section four. This Lacroix doesn't stand a chance. What? My drink. Right. It's. Do you usually think of consuming beverages as like a, a competition? No, no. Like you're against it. No, no. It's just like I'm gonna. Things? I'm like gonna demolish it. Okay. Like I try to savor it, but like oh, it's gonna be gone really soon. Exactly. So now I can just go over here. It's weird that because you block the opposite one, but like because I'm the black one, I'm naturally drawn towards the black line. Yeah. And like I've seen the similar line. games where like where like the opposite is what you need. Yeah. Let's just go do it. Yeah. Let's do it simultaneously. Oh, oh, that, okay, that was. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good start. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, okay, let's let, let's let's not do the rushing over to them. I'm gonna rush. Then. 
Okay. I'm rushing. Okay. <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh, I made it. Oh, yeah, except that's yours. yours. Is up here. <laughs> Yeah, well, I just want to, I just want to. Don't, don't, buddy. Uh, yes, you gotta get that out of here. Let me, let me get you across first. Okay. Alright, don't hit that yet, because it might spawn some of the things. <sighs> this one, this one just, like... Yeah, it'll, it should send it back. I know it's a nice blue background, but it's real stressful. Oh. Vendetta. This one's called Vendetta, which is not nice. Is there a key in it? Yeah. It's V for Vendetta. Oh this yeah, I see the guy Fox mask, you know, now that you mention it. That guy looks like Hugo Weaving. This isn't fun when, like, you can't move fast. I think if you just go left, it'll, like, catch up, because you're so slow. What do you mean? No. <laughs> it almost worked. Almost. You have to go down a little bit. Nailed it. Get over there. Uh, Wait, but you need, you need, you need. Oh, me. we both have to do it, and then like. Oh, oh. oh. I like this. Ready? Mm -hmm. Go. Three, two. Oh, okay. I went. I went. I went. <laughs> and it starts to count down, Mark. <laughs> Oh, you're right fine. Here. They they run out eventually. You don't even need to worry about anything. Look at this cocky, oh, cocky oh. jerk! Ah! Ooh, I got real small there. <laughs> well, there you're first. No, <laughs> no. Yo, you wanna you wanna help me out over here, buddy? You're so confident that they just run out. Well, not some of them. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I? You have to get me underneath. Yeah. Oh. Now get that. It's that. Um. It's the weird momentum. Control. Yeah. Control. And at first I was gonna say like, oh man, those controls don't feel great, but I feel like it's intentionally designed that way. Cause you gotta like kind of commit and plan out your movements a bit more. Mm. Like. Cause, Cause like if my timing is bad on a on a movement then like I can't just save it. You know? You're getting your head skin. Okay. Good save. Too. And then we can probably finish the rest. Yeah, of now them. we just gotta now I just gotta remember to avoid the black ones. Yeah. Alright, I'm in it. You know, I really think that this game is saying something powerful about race. <laughs> You gotta be afraid of your own kind, really. Yeah. The, dif the different people mm. are, are your friends. Mm. Or it's saying that you can fight the different ones. <laughs> no, heaven, <laughs> stop! <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking away your hood pass. Okay, that's fine. Oh, well, that was cool. Oh, we got some friends back. Do you, do you, do you love us now? Do you love us? Oh, look, there's something over here. It's okay, I can Well, you know, the thing is, I don't need, I don't need you to have my hood pass. I can just put my hood up right now. Oh, I passed. There's a hood pass. Street pass? I miss street pass. I'm almost looking forward to getting to the back. Yeah. Like, might have a nice like, So there's 12 stages. Thing. Huh? That one had 16. Faith had 16. Okay, okay. So, they so vary. it varies. I'm just to see what how they what the distinctions between chapters are. Transfer. Oh, what, what are we transferring? Yeah, 
not sure what I think that we're doing. soaking up. I can give you growth. Can I give you? Can I, can I give you? Yes. Oh. Oh, I get it. Okay, now I get it. Okay, wait. So how do we show that we get it? And we have to be the correct size in order to go inside the holes. Probably. At least relatively the same size. We're no longer circles or triangles. Why is this courage and not dependence? Try force. Eh, uh, whoa. Oh. Why are you doing that? I'm Wait. gonna get deleted. You gotta. You, you need to be team. fat. Yeah. I am there. Where do I go? All right, buddy. It's all you. The things are in the top left corner. <laughs> the answer is somewhere. It's gonna keep going. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, oh mistakes. Oh. That's 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 kind of trippy. Wait. Okay, well we know it's not in the left. Oh. Oh, I see black down there. Wait, what? I see. Oh yeah, I see black down there too. No, no, I see the black. Oh. Oh, hey. I found it, apparently. Oh, <clears throat> that was cool. Yeah. You're gonna transfer it all to you. Three, yeah. three, three more. Slower when you're fatter. Mm -hmm. How re you know this game is really being very realistic right now? Well, it is a it's a space shaped game. It's my favorite genre. Is it a physics? Is it physics based? How is this physics based? It's physics based in the sense of you gotta oh give me so give me more so that you can yeah so that you can be quick and dark. Physics. This is a really good mechanic. I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. I didn't feel ready. I guess. Yo. Oh, wait, hey, what just doing? happened? <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. <laughs> Starting closer to the top makes yeah. sense now. Is that a cat? I'm gonna make you big. That's a good idea. That's what she said. And then, uh, you gotta do a switcheroo somehow. I'm gonna go down here. You can make me big. Oh! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What's that guy doing there? Okay. Come on down. Oh, no! What was I supposed to do about it? I don't know. So what's the game plan here? Um, so I'm going up to the top, like, yeah. to block that white stream. Yeah. And you're going to shoot from the bottom left corner, mm -hmm. so that you don't get hit by mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. There's another thing that, have, that black thing. You basically, well, I mean, wow, that hits both at the same time. So as long as one of them's passed. I can't tell if it overlaps with the one or not. They do a little bit. So first it's that one, and then it's one from right there, and then it's the black one. So our window's like now. 
Because now it never does. Oh god. Oh god! <laughs> Just choke, Evan. Just choke. I don't call you B-Rabbit. Why? Because he chokes? Have you ever seen 8 Mile? Oh. Switch, switch, switch. Oh, you got it. You got it. Oh, you got it, buddy. Oh, close. Okay. It looked good, though. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm There's also probably a little bit simpler way. Here's our window. Go, 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 Feed me, feed me. Oh, oh no. And go down, go down. Oh, where is it? No, not like this. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Liberty. We did it. We did it. All right, guys. We got through the first two sections. Uh, testaments. <laughs> That's for you. First um, testaments. What do you? What are your? Courage. What are your? What are your kind of like impressions so far? I don't really know what to think about this game. It's interesting. I really like how it's designed. I feel. I mean, it's like we were talking about earlier. Like, I'm more impressed with how they're coming up with new puzzles and stuff than I am feeling like I'm enjoying the act of solving the puzzles. Yeah. It's really relaxing, though. It kind of makes it hard to solve the puzzles, because, like, I'm, I want to just lean back and listen to the, f the fountain sounds, mm -hmm. and, like, the, whatever, the paint splatter effects, whatever the foley's are. I think that second round of levels, Courage, was more fun. I think, yeah, they, like, adding the second mechanic of, like, transferring size, weight, mm -hmm. I think added another interesting layer to it, which makes me excited about what levels there are left yeah um, and like what else they could add um, but but yeah I mean I think it's a beautiful game I think it's like it, it like has a really confident sense of like like it's like really confident in its design both like visually and from a game design perspective yeah and from like art and visual. Yeah, and Sonic thing too. Yeah, it's it's like a really well made game. Mm -hmm. um, it's interesting because it's it's I mean, as someone who likes puzzle games, like there's something about this that's not as dopamine inducing as other puzzle games that I play, and I'm wondering what that is. Yeah, I think for me it's kind of like, at least for me, this might not be what you're looking for, but I don't feel like we have had the aha moments, or it's not like when you solve a puzzle it's like, oh I figured out how to do it, like you kind of know yeah. what you're supposed to do and you're just figuring out the mechanics of doing it, so the enjoyment isn't coming from figuring it out so much, it's like executing it, but because the controls aren't like super precise, the active doing it doesn't feel um, as great. Mm -hmm. I would say that's oh. probably a fair assessment. Um, yeah, I don't know, like when... Like, uh, for some reason I feel like comparing this game to Portal 2, and maybe it's just because it's a puzzle-solving mm -hmm. cooperative game, but like, with Portal 2 there would be moments when you'd step into a chamber and like, you'd, you'd think, Oh, I have no idea how I'm supposed to solve this. And then when you eventually figure it out, like one, the the solution is like, oh, this is really cool, and 
the act of doing it is fun too, and for this one it feels like both of those are kind of lacking a little bit. I also think there's a, a level of tedium that comes with playing this. Mm -hmm. Like, I feel like trying to make the game respond to what you want it to do is is like a little cumbersome and yeah. and then if you mess up um oftentimes when you feel like it's not your fault yeah like that's and, and you have to repeat the entire sequence over e even after you figured out how to do it yeah like i don't i don't think that's yeah, that doesn't feel great doesn't feel great at all for some reason i feel like this game would make a lot of sense on mobile yeah, like, I could see this being kind of like a Monument Valley type thing, like you pick it up on your phone and you do like a puzzle at a time, mm -hmm. sitting down and playing it for long chunks doesn't seem like the right way to play this. Which is, is it's cool that it's on the Switch because you can take it like wherever and just mm -hmm. pull it out for like 5-10 minutes and kind of relax. But yeah, it's not the kind of game to like sit down with and play in a 3 hour session or something. Yeah, and I wonder what it would... Like, just going off of your mobile game idea, like, I wonder what this game would be like if it had collectibles. Or, like, if there was some sort of scoring system where, where like, yeah, you know, that would be there was, like, too. three stars. And then you can solve the puzzle and, like, maybe get one star, but there's extra challenges. Uh, yeah. Maybe. Well, like, like, that one section when we had those... Uh, symbols that we're trying to usher from one side to the yeah. other. That's definitely like getting across with all of them. Like give you three stars mm -hmm. and getting across. We like if we were being graded, we would have gotten one star on that. Yeah, it's definitely interesting. But like since the game's not designed with that in mind, like it wouldn't. It, it definitely wouldn't work. But it would. It would be an interesting thing to have included. It would have given a little bit more intricacy to to the relatively simple puzzles. Yeah, well, this actually reminds me of a puzzle game that we reviewed, like, years ago. Um, yeah. And it and, and it was a mobile game. It was... It it, it felt like this. It, like, it, like, had a very strong visual design. It was, it was like, a very confident game. Mm -hmm. um, but I think it was more successful in, like, in, like, what it was trying to do. Um, and not to say that this game isn't fun or, or that it's, but like, there's just, there's just something missing that um, I yeah. think, like other puzzle games capture pretty well. This one just seems kind of dull. Um, it's kind of like, we're just kind of playing it. Yeah. We're not like unraveling it. We're just kind of like going through it. Um, yeah, I'd agree with that. I don't know. I, I, would would you say uh, would you encourage people to check this one out? Um, do you know what the price tag is on it? I actually don't off the top of my head. Okay, that might that might be good because I don't really like recommending games just based off of like yeah. the amount of money normally. But I think that does kind of matter. I think that people should um, check out the game, check out the gameplay trailers. Um, see like what we've done, and if it seems like something that you'd be into, then I think it's definitely worth checking out. But it's not definitely not a game for everyone, yeah. and I don't think like uh, like some puzzle games are so good that you'd recommend them to like anybody. Even yeah. if like you're not a puzzle game fan, like you should still check this out for whatever reason. I don't think this one has enough of that crossover appeal. Mm -hmm. But I think that if this seems like the kind of game that you would like, then you should definitely check it out. So I think it it just depends on the person. I personally wouldn't... I like some puzzle games, but I don't think I enjoy this type of game enough to really like go out and play it for myself or go out and purchase it um, for me. So Would you, would you play this out. with your partner? Because that's kind of the lens that I'm coming at this from. Is, is that's like, interesting. It's like, would yeah, I... I've, Actually, probably will. 
Yeah. I don't know if like it, it wouldn't be a game that I would commit to completing all the way through, but it would be fun to just like pull it up for like thirty minutes or like yeah. twenty minutes and just kind of mess around with it. But yeah. I think I mean we played Death Square too when uh, we played Mario Party. 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 Yeah. Um, like that's a similar game. It's like everyone needs to be working yeah. together. It's 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 dependent on good communication. Everyone resets if one person messes up. Yeah. So it's you know really similar in mm-hmm. in several ways, and. Um, I don't know, for me, there was something about it that was just more immediately fun. I think it was yeah. the tone of it, Definitely. maybe. Um, just, there's this inherent goofiness where, like, we're, like, we're, like, dying is part of the fun of yeah. it, you know? Yeah. You got to pick, like, your own silly little box things mm-hmm. you, you, like, kind of identified with the object. Yeah. Um, dying didn't feel bad it was it was like yeah. it was like funny you know it was it was it was this like collective like like oh man like now I have to do it over Where, yeah. whereas in this game it feels more like oh man now I have to do it over you know yeah. so um I think it's interesting just like talking about these subtle differences just because um I mean by all accounts, like this is, uh, I would, I would say that this is a very well-made game. Yeah, definitely. Um, but I mean, there are puzzle games that that I probably recommend more, or like say that yeah. they're more yeah, agree with that. enjoyable. Um, so yeah, just kind of wondering if we could put to words like what that feeling is. So, um, and I guess these are our first impressions of this. Yeah. Well, good. good game, well-made game, definitely not for everyone, and kind of hard to, to recommend because of that. Yeah. But I mean, if you liked what you saw, um, I mean, what you see is what you get. There's, yeah. I know there's definitely more surprises, um, and, and you know, may, maybe some of these later levels is like where it really t- takes off but um mm-hmm. but like from what we've seen so far like i think um you know good not great good not great yeah yeah all right well that's what i feel i think uh, i think we're gonna pack it up um thanks for watching remember that you can uh Give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Uh, sub, uh, subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications. Uh, share it with your friends and, uh, you know, be nice to people. Be nice to people.